<laughs> I'm playing with my emojis because I was told earlier by someone that they were coming and stealing my emoji button from me <laughs> on Robin's chat. So I'm playing with my emojis. Hello, hello, hello. We're back, we're back, we're back. Oh, for sure, for sure, for sure. <laughs> you guys all fail. You, that's it. You guys fail. <laughs> Sorry. So who was over at Robin's today and um, someone threatened to take away my emoji button? Was anybody there? Write me if you were over there. And I got threatened. Should I stop? <laughs> Betty Webb. <laughs> Casual flippers like, yup. Frank Perez was like, yup. Mary Ness was like, me. Who was that? Who was that woman? Robin's laughing. Robin, this one's for you, honey. This one's for you. How's that? There you go. That one's for you. Hold on. Wait a second. Do you suffer from FOMO? What's FOMO? Fear of missing out. Do you find yourself calling into work or skipping school just to catch that next auction? I can't go to sleep. I might miss something. Now there's FOMO by Fluffer. Coming to a pharmacy near you. Remember? <laughs> Remember everyone? Welcome back, you guys. Thank you so much. My very first thank you goes to Miss Mama G for being in the chat. Thank you, Mama G. Appreciate you. So, uh, so my jewelry giveaway contest. See you ladies later. Susie Q's having a jewelry giveaway contest. I don't know when. Ruth Bond, hello. Thank you for being here. Mo Isaac. Hey, Mo. I never get notified when you're going on. I just shut your channel down and then came back on, refreshing everything, subscribed again, and hit the bell. I hope that helps. Have a great night. Thank you, Mo. Thank you, Mo. Yeah, sometimes here. that does help. Sometimes that does help for whatever reason. Going to be joining you this evening. Hopefully you are just up the road we are just up the road in Jacksonville. Oh. And I have their registration. Okay, awesome. Let me give you a wrench. Um, I'm hoping to be in Jacksonville next weekend. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see if it works. Um, not yet. Yeah, well, it's a week from this. Okay. So it's, 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 not, it's Saturday and Sunday, right? It would be yeah. a week from Saturday and Sunday. Yeah. All right. There's your wrench. And you got it. Thank you so much for the registration and welcome to the family. Everybody say hello to Fexy. Fexy. Is that how you say it, Fexy? Oh, look what's not on. Oh, no. The lava lamp. All right. You guys get to watch it warm up. Hi, Rhonda. Remember to include your full shipping address. Did you fix that yet? No. Okay. That's all right, T. You get a pass. You get a pass. I'm not going to give you a hard time. And Dora is wrenched. Dora is wrenched. So um, I spoke to Dora today. Hello, Moses. Hey, Moses. Moses is waiting. Ooh, when Moses speaks, you guys, we all need to listen. What are you waiting for, Moses? <laughs> Frank Perez, hello, welcome in. Mary Ness, Joe, hello to the chat. I hope you're home and safe. Worry about you out there. Virginia, my mom, Mama G, you missed what happened in the good news with Donna. <laughs> yeah, it was funny. Hi, Laura, jewelry, etc. Hello, sweetheart. Jen Bennett, hi, honey. Hope you are well also. All right, Wonder Woman, Amber, hi there. Good to see you. James Cisco, the Martini Man. Hi, Kyle. Bolo Buddies, 
So big announcement, folks. Huge announcement. Bolo Buddies is returning. We're going to be on. She's invited me to come on and co-host her big return tomorrow night, 10 p.m. on Bolo Buddies channel. If you haven't had a chance to check out Bolo Buddies yet, you are going to absolutely love it. So for those of you that are new to the channel, uh, please go over and subscribe to Courtney. And Bolo stands for Be On The Lookout. And what she does is she invites uh, people on in the chat to uh, have their their eBay item number ready and you put it in the chat and you give a quick little bought it at a yard sale, 50 cents, sold it for $50, that sort of thing. And she'll highlight it on the screen. She'll profile your store. It gives people an opportunity to see your store and, and uh, it's really awesome. It's really awesome. She used to do it every Wednesday night and she took a little bit of a break from it, but she's back. And so tomorrow night's the big return, 10 o'clock tomorrow night. I hope to see you all there. So please go over, Courtney, when you have a chance, drop your link. Um, Thank you, Courtney. And congratulations to Donna and Brian and you, Courtney. You guys have been really the, um, the success of my channel and getting me over that hump. Yay. I'm thank dropping you. importance already. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, T made 2,000. Mm, sorry, 1,500. I said 2,000 earlier. It is 2,000. Oh, it is 2,000. Okay, sorry. I thought it was 2,000. And then you correct me earlier. She no. made 2,000 subscribers today, you guys. Brian helped over at Mr. Bra Buys a Lot. And, and Courtney um, gave me a big shout out in her group today and a video. So thank you. Thank you. And um, I am releasing a video that's um, going to drop at some point. Um, and if you go over and watch that video and leave a comment and a thumbs up and you're subscribed to the channel, you're going to be entered to win in the 2000 giveaway during coffee on Saturday morning. Awesome. Junebug. Hello, Donna T and friends. Can't think of a happier place to spend the evening than with friends that consider family and supporting the best sellers on YouTube. Thank you, Junebug. You're so sweet. Hey, Mimi. Woodbine, hello, sweetheart. Hello to everyone. Casual flipper, thank you. Julie, welcome back. Hey, Julie. Because she shed, welcome in. Yeah, <laughs> Amber. Hey. Ooh, ah, crochet. Ooh, ah, crochet. Carol Ann, thank you for being here. Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Shell UK. Hey, Shell. Thanks, everyone, for strolling in. Hi, Pammy. Hi, Pammy. Jabby's Treasures, welcome back. Hey, Jabby. There's the other one. There's the other troublemaker. Victoria. Victoria. <laughs> Hi, Victoria. Picture. Nice. Yeah, it's pretty. Michelle P. Did I say hi to you, honey? Hello, sweetheart. Michelle. I'm going to try to get you a shipping quote tomorrow to Australia, honey, on that Star Wars stuff. Joy Munkin. I'm getting caught up, you guys. I sent out a whole bunch of invoices today. Sent out a whole bunch of packages. Still have a lot more to go. Agent Stereo's in the house. Hello. Hey, Ken. Hi, Thanks Ken. for coming in. Good to see you. Haven't seen you in a while. Yeah. And beautiful Joy Munkin. Hello, Joy. Joy, I still got to talk to you about that Winnie the Pooh that you shouted me out about. I, I looked everywhere and I don't see a Winnie the Pooh. So we need to chat. Try to call me tomorrow. Cool Ranch Dorito. I still got to ship your oh, time. I need to change to picture too. Nice. Hello, sweetheart. Good to see you. And KK's in the house. KK. Hi, KK. And Larry. Hello, Larry. Thank you for being hi, here. Ash, what's going on? Joanne, hi. Hey, Joanne. Punisher, hello. <laughs> Punisher. You know what? <laughs> hey, Punisher. I did get a mouth. <laughs> I did get a mouth. Thank you for asking. Thank you so much. <laughs> hey, Chandra. 
Hey, Chandra. And Annie. Hey, haven't seen you in a while either. Good morning to you. And it's Dawn and Mary. Hello, Dawn and Mary. Dawn and Mary. Hey, Dawn. I stopped in there today, too, and said a quick hello. Carolina lady, there's another face we haven't seen in a while. Hey, Carolina lady. Well, we're not seeing her face. We're seeing her doggy's face. But still, good enough. I'm glad that you're here. Thank you for coming. Thank you for checking in. We appreciate you very, very much. Brenda Miller. Hey, Brenda. Thank you. And Froggy. Hey, Froggy. Hello, Froggy. Kimmy. Kimberly. What's up, girl? Hello, Kimberly. Back from her little... Uh, Tramping around, well, in a good way, <laughs> not in a bad way. Tammy, did I say hi to you? Hello, Tammy. Harley Kitten. Hey, Harley. Hey, Tammy. And Susan. Who is Susan? Is Susan wrenched? Because I'm on. I'm on. Susan is wrenched. Susan is wrenched. Oh, I'm also looking for um, Mr. Turtle Trader. Hi. Um, during my, um, when I did my um, storage auction, um, an Amber D bought something and she's wrenched, but we don't have the um, registration for Amber D. If anybody sees Amber D around, her things are going to come back to auction. I don't have her registration. She was wrenched. So I'm thinking it's somebody who maybe changed their YouTube name and didn't tell us. So I have no way of finding out who Amber D is. So if anybody sees Amber D, please tell them that I'm looking for her. Um, American Tide, welcome. Welcome. Thank you for being here. And Janice, hello. Thank you for being here and welcome. Uh oh. Why is Bolo Buddies doing this? No, no, no. Did, I, did I say something bad? I don't know. What did I say? What did I say? What did I say? I don't know what I said. I don't know. Punisher, you tattletale. Talk about it. Carol and Susan. I don't know what they're talking about. And I'm not going to go back to see. Just talk, just talk amongst each other. You're fine. <laughs> Hello, Sheila. Welcome in. Thank Hi you. there. Thank you for being here. Okay. So for those of you that are new, thank you so much for being here. Um, all we ask is that you follow Mama G's prompt. Uh, Bolo busted. What did you say, Donna? I don't know. I don't know what I said. I don't know what I said. Um, let's see. Here is the Google Doc. If you click on that and fill it out, and please, when you fill it out, put not just your street address, but your state and city. Those two lines are missing, but use the same line as the address. Um, and as soon as we receive your registration, you will get a blue wrench and match everybody else. Um, and... Tonight is $10 Tuesday, which means that sometimes we present $10 items and, and then sometimes we start things off at $10. And if there's only one bid on that $10 item, guess what? You get it for $10. So we try to do reseller lots, but we also do one-offs, meaning for personal use as well. But sometimes our one-offs can be a bolo um, where you can turn around and you can sell it. Hey, so me. Hi, honey. Christopher, hello, Connie. Long time no see, honey. Hi, hi, honey. Good to see you. So good to see you, Christopher. Thanks for coming in. And um, let's see. We bid in two dollar increments. Um, unless it's a buy it now, we will let you know if it's a buy it now. And up to fifty, and then we do five dollar increments. And if it goes to a hundred, then we do ten dollar increments. So my name is Donna. I'm your host tonight. Um, I live in Florida, and next to me this way is T, and she's um, on Long Island, and she has a channel called Auctions for You, and her and I co-host with each other, and we take turns going back and forth on each other's channels. Hey, Donna Quigley, welcome in, and I appreciate, hi, Misha, there she is, boop, there you are. 
Hi there. Hi, honey. Thanks for coming in. Good to see you, Misha. My Rumi. name's Mama G, and I live in the interwebs, and I will be your <laughs> translator tonight. That's Mama G. That's Mama G on the bottom. That's Mama G. And without Mama G, T and I probably wouldn't be able to do this. Long Island tea. Ice tea. <laughs> Long Island uh, sweet iced tea is what everybody calls her. Sweet tea. So, okay. Hey, Tim, too. <laughs> hey, Kyle. <clears throat> did I say hi to Kyle? I don't know if I did. Hi, Tim, too. Welcome in. And Kyle, thank you. Thank you for being here. Thanks for spending your evening with us. So we normally do, uh, let's see, $10 Tuesdays on my channel. We are going to start doing one-off Wednesdays on T's channel. And um, Thursday nights, we're back on T's. Friday nights, we're on my channel. Saturday nights, we're on T's. And Sunday, we're figuring that out. We're going to be alternating week to week. And also join us on T's channel every uh, Saturday and Sunday morning for coffee with T and Donna at 10 o'clock. And sometimes that fluctuates. It depends on like if we have something going on like this weekend, I was cleaning out an estate. T was cleaning out a storage unit. We did manage to make it on at 10 o'clock, but sometimes, you know, it fluctuates. So just, you know, check the notifications. Well, we no, Saturday, I think we did 11, right? Didn't we? I think we did. Yeah. So check. Yeah. Maybe we did. Oh, we did an auction. Auction. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we did. Did an auction, which reminds me tomorrow morning, uh, 10 o'clock. No, 10 o'clock. Oh, yes. Yeah. 10 o'clock, 10 o'clock on oh, T's. Oh, are you calling me? No. Oh, that's okay. I thought he was saying mama. <laughs> Lola. Oh, Lola. He's calling. I thought he was saying mama. Lola's his girlfriend, you guys. So um, 10 o'clock, we're going to do coffee on T's channel for midday coffee. And we're going to roll right into a um, one-off Wednesday auction. And then tomorrow night on Bolo Buddies. So yeah, we've got a really packed week of events. Did you want to say anything to you? <laughs> no i'm good i'm good thank you i'll just sit back for a second if you have something you want to say no i'm good I'm are good. you sure yeah you know no announcements no nothing <laughs> i i already thanked everybody thank you for getting me to 2k i am going to be releasing a video be on the lookout for that you will have to comment in that video to be entered to win a 2,000 subscriber. What time Wednesday for tea? 10 a.m. We're going to do coffee Wednesday mornings. Tomorrow morning. Yeah. Yeah. Do you have the link for it yet? I don't. I was going to try to do it, and I just, you okay. know, it's been crazy. But you know what? If I can, it'll take me real quick. I can do it real fast. Okay. Um, and I can get it done before we, we go off. Oh, thanks, Christopher. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> um, so yeah, we'll we'll go on at 10. We'll do a little coffee chit chat, then we'll roll right into an auction. Um, and then we'll um we always follow at 1 p.m. Eastern with Brian, Mr. Buys a lot. Um, he goes on Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and then he's on from one to four, and then Donna will be on. Courtney's tomorrow night. So make sure you guys are dropping that link. Please subscribe to Courtney. Please make sure you have your notification bell on. She's picking up right where she left off a few months ago, 10 p.m. Eastern Wednesday nights. Donatella, I'm pretty sure the Amber you're looking for has her last name different. Might be why you can't find her. She bought from me. I'll text you who I think it is. Cool. All right. Westside Gary, you guys, he's our next project. We need to get him to a thousand subscribers. So if you haven't joined Gary, drop your link, honey. If you haven't joined Westside Gary, he also has auctions on his channels on Saturday night. He's in California, so he goes on a little bit later. Um, 
but yeah, I don't know if he's going to do them once a month or once every two, twice a month. I don't, I don't know his schedule. I, I don't know my schedule, so I can't keep track of other people's schedules. Um, but there he is. Yeah, go subscribe to Gary. He has, he finds some really cool stuff. It's really exciting. <laughs> That's the one who told me she was going to take my emoji button away from me. Hi, Susan Arrington. Susan. Hello, sweetheart. Um, yeah. So 114 of you here. I think this is a good time to start. I appreciate each and every one of you coming in. Hey, Sandy. Hey, Thank Kyle. You. Hey, Frank. All right. I hope everybody had a nice day. It's beautiful here in South Florida. I hope the weather is pleasant where you are. It's in the 70s here every day and sunny. It's so gorgeous. I'm going to take you guys for a ride someday this week. So you can see how just it's the air is so crisp and clean right now. I love it. I love it. Coming out of the summertime, you know, the summertime, the, it's, you know, heavy. The air is very heavy down here. Um Oh, okay, Kimmy. You think that's who it is? Thank you. We'll see. We'll see if she comes into the chat and we can ask her. Um, colder than cold and raining, Elizabeth says. Yeah, which is why I moved to Florida. Okay, Kimmy. Thank you so much. <gasps> 37 degrees. It's still not terrible for January. I'm okay with that. 37s, yeah. I mean, 37s. I mean, if it, you know, 32. That's when it starts to get like, 37 is can be on the on on the warmer side, right? Yeah, and especially if it's not windy, and you know, it's when we get like below 30, and then the wind chill factor, play, you know, goes in, and yeah, when you step outside. Well, look at how cold it is here. That yeah, that's chilly for you guys. That's our winters. Our winters are like between 55 and like 60, 65. And our days are like 70, you know, 73s like that. So, um, yeah. Okay, T, I'm going to put you up unless you want me to go first. Are you Are you ready? No, you I'll figure it out. Down? I'll figure it out. Okay, so I'm going to put you on right now. If, all right. I kind of didn't prepare anything, but I have plenty of stuff around me. And because she doesn't have anything. Oh, and you you say the same thing all the time, so I don't want to hear it, lady. <laughs> I, I have something right here I can show, which is wicked awesome for a ten dollar start. And she has something too. So there you go. Tees up first. Bam. Yeah. There you go. The Grateful Dead. The Grateful Dead. Wow. Does that have a date on it? 2004, I believe. Did I see it? No. Right on the other side. Keep going. Did I see it somewhere? It's down there on the bottom, yep. but we can't see it. Yep. 2004. But what's it say on the very bottom? The very bottom says Oakland, California, December 30th and 31st. No, the signature on the very bottom. Oh, yeah. Is this one of the ones that's signed? Yeah, this is signed. This is signed. Who's it signed by? Um, so this is 155 this is, out of 900. Yeah, this is Kelly the Artist. Okay. $10 start. $10 start, guys. Hey, Cheryl's in the house. Hello, Willow. Welcome in, sweetheart. Good to see you. Hey, Willow. Hi, hey, honey. What's going Very on? Good to see you. Happy New Year, Cheryl. Ten dollars start, you guys, on the poster. Wonder Woman comes in at ten dollars. She's like, no, nope, oh, I think Janine was in first, but okay. Janine was oh, in Janine, first. Janine, I'm sorry, I, I missed it. Sorry, honey. Sorry. Really clean, very sturdy, and definitely not ever posted up. No signs of stickiness or anything that the poster was ever used. Actually says 2003 and four because I guess it was it was probably December 30th, 2003, which rolled into midnight for December 2000 or January 2004. Since those concert dates were were um, at 30th and 31st, probably rolled after midnight. And that's why it says 2003 and 2004. Basic dimensions, T. 
Um, yeah, I can do that. I can do that. I have a tape. So we have 23 across and 20 high. 23 across, 20 high. Or the official measurement of the auctions. My head. <laughs> All right. Uh, I think Wonder Woman's out. If there's no other interest, we're going to call it to Janine for 20. You can fold it in half. No, nope. Christopher Chatworth's going to come in for 25. Thank you, Christopher. And maybe I'm going to sweeten the pot a little bit and bring this awesome photo. Let's include the photo in the lot. Let's include the photo in the lot. It's a press photo. Every Kyle is doing well. Good to hear, Kyle Elliott. Thank you for answering for Kyle. <laughs> oh. oh, that's good to hear, um, Victoria. Um, it's so crazy with you guys with blood sugar. Please watch yourselves. Please keep an eye on it. Be, eat, be eating little meals every every so many hours every so many hours oh my gosh wendy that's crazy that is crazy all right are we calling this soul to christopher congratulations christopher All right. Let's grab. Let me just put this over here. Let's grab this bucket here. Let's grab this bucket here. And it says on the outside autos and gas pumps. Autos and gas pumps. Let's see what we have. I did not mark these. These came out of a storage unit. Um, hmm. They look old. <laughs> Uh, they look very old, so we'll start them at, out at ten dollars. We'll start them out at ten dollars. I don't know. I don't know if they're this rough that they're still worth anything, or anybody works on them like they work on regular cars. These two are dinky. Yes, people do restore them. Do they? Oh yeah, this one too, dinky again. Oh, I thought when you said the word dinky, like you meant it. <laughs> Small. <laughs> I'm like, okay. she just used the word dinky to describe that car. <laughs> Is that one dinky too? That looks kind it's of big. dinky too. Yes. <laughs> it's a little big. It doesn't look so dinky. <laughs> oh, this one looks like a. Uh... <laughs> Andrea's laughing. She's like, me too. Yeah, <laughs> She's like that girl. That's a tootsie. Julie, Julie, you've never used the word dinky to describe something small. <laughs> oh Seriously. Seriously. You guys have never used the word dinky. <laughs> Victoria wants to know if they're all dinky. Um, there are some Tootsie toys as well. It's a it's a serious question. Don't pay any attention to the laughing emojis that are going along with it. <laughs> As of right now, we don't have any Hot Wheels that would be red lines, guys. No, but I will have some coming. I did come across some. I just haven't put them together yet, but I will have some. Um, oh, interesting, Kimberly. You don't know what Dinky is? <laughs> she just wrote, um, no. <laughs> oh, my God. That's there happen to be any Volkswagens in there, T? Volkswagens. 
I don't know. I'm trying to line them up on a tray to make it easier for you guys. Kimberly, that's probably more information that you should share with everybody right now. <laughs> What is what is she sharing? <laughs> I'm just gonna mute myself about right now. Why? Why are you muting yourself? I'll mute yourself. It's okay. It's all good. We're all friends here at the auction. This one's really rough, but I don't know. Maybe it's worth something. I don't know. Some of them are really, really. They're no, really Susanna. Good. Not at all, sweetheart. Not at all. What's the matter? What's the matter with Susanna? Nothing. She just asked me a question and I just responded. All right. Um, that's what we have so far. I think for the most part, they're almost all dinky. Um, and then it did say gas pumps in here. So there are a couple of, there's just, there's like a ton of stuff in here. I don't know what's what. And there looks like some pieces and some like that looks like the top to a tanker. And this is this is what I can see as far as shrink and dinky. <laughs> as far as the dinky toys are concerned. But then there's other pieces in here, and this is what's still left in here. Can so we see that can we see the other dinky? <laughs> So you guys can can have a party in here. I don't know what else is in here, but I'm going to include it all. I'm going to include it all. So you're going to get all of that and everything that's on this tray. Lots of dinkiness going on over there. <laughs> Mama G comes in at 16. She loves dinkies. <laughs> oh. So yeah, so it's everything here. So on here, you've got Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen pieces. There's probably at least another eighteen pieces in here as well. Um, I don't know. This guy like just put things in places. I don't know. You know. There's another one. Oh, somebody asked about a Volks. No, it's not a Volkswagen. I thought it might have been. These are smaller cars. These are these are smaller than the other ones. There's a lot of these in here. And then that's oops. Um, that's like the front of. I don't know if that other piece falls in here. There's actually two of these. No, this doesn't. I don't think. Oh, maybe it does. I don't know. That piece and that piece. Oh, and there are some plastic army trucks, what looks to be some trucks in here. Here's another metal front. Maybe that fits on there. I don't know. Get some more smaller cars. And you've got this global van lines, this back piece, and you've got this back piece of, I'm not sure what that says. Just generic. Kyle's, Kyle's saying they're Tootsie cars. They're not slot cars or anything like that. Oh, the little ones? Yeah, that's what he said. Okay. This is a metal, it says Oram lamps. And again, still there's still there's still all that in there too. So again. Mm -hmm. Oh, and then you have two um his and hers <laughs> outhouses or gasoline uh, the rest stops <laughs> the old gasoline red stops in there and again still still more in there so you'll get it full get everything in there hey 
Hey, American Tide. Thanks, Renee. 42 from Vintage Memories. Thank you. Okay, found my measuring tape and lost my pen. How does that happen? Story of my life. That steak bed truck is cool. Thank you, Gary. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, Mr. Turtle Trader. Thank you, Woodbine Girl. Thank you, Vintage Memories. T. Renee yep. misses you bunches. Aw, thanks, Renee. I'll see you on Friday. She's been having to put up with the boys by herself. <laughs> All right, we have vintage memories at 48. Let us know. Woodbine Girl says out. Let us know, Mr. Turtle Trader. 50 would be the next bid. Hey, Boatman, Boatman. Thank you, Chandra. I know. Managed payments is a doozy, right? I've been on it for a while. My husband just got on it, so I, I know. It's like, and, and for it not to go to PayPal, and then you print a label, and there's no funds to print a label. It's crazy. I'm still not on managed payments. Really? Yeah. When, was, when were they going to flip me over? I thought everybody was being flipped over last year, but who knows? Maybe with what, you know, with, with the pandemic and everything, I don't know. You know, it might have. I don't think you have to sign up, Gary. You're just going to get notified that you've moved over. That's what happened to my husband. I inadvertently, voluntarily signed up. Big mistake. Like two on years ago, right? Didn't it first come yeah, out? Like two years whatever. Ago? You know, I, 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 it's fine. It's fine. You know, after a while, it's fine. It's just, it takes some getting used to. Oh, see, Victoria said she's not on it either. And neither is Andrea Baker. She said oh, that we okay. go over mid February. Okay. I mean, when they, when they flip it over for me, I'll go. I mean, I'm not going to, you know, I'll go. Yeah. But yeah. That's, but I'm still like not on it, which is strange. It seems like everybody's on it. But I just saw two people that are not. Yeah, that's the good thing, James, because I've had two over my lifetime. See, James writes, no more PayPal cases. I've had people do that only twice, though, thank God. They went right to PayPal and or disputed it with PayPal on their credit card. Sold. Thank you. Thank sold, you. Sold, sold. Finish memories? 48. Yep. Thank you. Thank you, Vintage Memories. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> she said, thanks, Mama GT. Put my tray down. <laughs> Marilyn, welcome in. Happy New Year, honey. Happy New Year, Marilyn Gani. How Good are you? Good to see you. Good to see you. I hope you're well. I hope you're well. All right, let's see if there's any interest in this. Um, I actually have two pieces of this. I, I'm trying to pull as many posters and pictures and things that are going to be easier to ship than the big, than the big stuff. So for my country people in the chat, there are two posters. Hank and Cash. And I'll give you a measurement on them. Again, they look like they've never been hung. I don't see any signs of any um, sticky stuff on the back. I will tell you, though, that the, the Hank Williams one does have a little imperfection here, which kind of shows up in the back of the poster. But for the most part, they're clean. 
Um, this one has a Virgin Records um, stamp on it, probably hung in the store. Oh, actually, they both do. Actually, they were probably hung in the music store for this. And $10 start on those. You get both. And I'll tell you what they are width and height wise. So the width on these are 11 and the height is 17. So the width is 11 and the height is 17 and you get two $10 start. Um, Janine, I don't know, honey. It doesn't say anywhere on here, to be honest with you. Um, one of them, oh, let's see. No, they both say limited edition exclusively for Vir Virgin. Oh, here it is. Megastores 2004. Yes, they both say the same thing. 2004. All right. Amy's going to come in for 10. Thank you, Amy. All right, what you got? You got $10 from Amy. Anyone else? If not, we're going to give it to Amy for $10. Cool Ranch Dorito. Johnny Cash and Hank Williams. Hey, Evil Lenny. All right, let's call it. <clears throat> All right, we're going to sell them for $10 to Amy. All right, sounds good. You sold. You got it, Amy. And guys, don't forget though, we're still doing the combined shipping. So, um, oh, that's that's three for me, Donna. You go, honey. So remember, thirty dollars free shipping. Anything combines. I don't know, Amy, if you have anything with me right now. So you know, unless you want them shipped immediately, and I'm probably first class, I'm sure, in a tube. So just let me know. You're up, honey. Okay. All right. Aw, that's okay, Turtle tra Trader. All right. I'll, I'll have more. All right. So I'm going to offer this as a $10 buy it now. Elizabeth Arden, Red Door Revealed. Looks like it's in excellent new condition. Elizabeth Arden, 10 Red door revealed ten dollars for the first person who writes me in the chat. If anybody likes this perfume, Christopher says me ten dollars. You got it, honey. All right. Okay, so CC for ten dollars. Red door perfume. Okay, this next one is going to be a $10 start. And it is this bag of all miniature perfumes. That one, I believe, says, I don't know what it says. I don't have my glasses here. Oh, yes, I do. I have my glasses. All right, Junebug starts us off at 10. Michael's in for 12. Julie now at 14. Perfume is my favorite thing to sell, Michael. and I'm selling it all tonight because I don't have time to list it. That's what I have in this bag. In addition to, um, it's kind of a mystery bag, Pure Linen by Estee Lauder. That's in there. There's people that collect these little mini bottles. There's that one there. Chris the Goose. Thank you, sweetheart, for the $5 super chat. You're a sweetheart. Happy New Year, Chris.
Is that Paloma Picasso? No, Perry Ellis. So I can't see with the glasses on. I can't see with the glasses off. 20 from Tammy, 22 from Lona. Okay, so I'll just show you the whole bag and you guys can just see what's in here. So it's 25 cents on the bag. I didn't pay 25 cents for it. <laughs> Tammy's in a 25. <clears throat> hey, Chris the Goose. Um, JJ was talking about your new YouTube channel that you're going to be doing videos on, and I cannot find that link. Could you please drop it for me? Big Barn. Oh, when, yeah, when it's a brand new channel, it's really hard to find it. Yeah, and I, think they follow, I think also they followed Big Barn auctions. I think they put Goose and JJ or something like that. I know I copied all of that and put it in there the way he had it written in the chat one night and still couldn't find it. Uh, Hi, Lana. Lana, 28 would be the next bid, honey. We're at 25 with Tammy. 27 would be the next bid. 27. Lana. Thank you. Sorry. Mama G, I can't find it either. <laughs> Chris. Ken, I think Ken said he could find it, Chris, in um when he was talking about it with JJ. But you guys are gonna have to figure that out. Help. 27. <clears throat> Thank you. Thirty to Tammy. Thank you, Tammy. Lawn is out. Let's sell it to Tammy. All right, we're gonna go once to Tammy at thirty. Tammy, Tammy. Thank you, Tammy. Lot number two, $30. Okay. Sold, sold, sold. Thank you, Tammy. I'll put it in your arsenal of stuff that's going out to you. Okay. This is my next one that I have. Um, I don't know anything about this company. This came out of the estate that I bought this past weekend. It is, uh, it says tea on it. And <clears throat> I guess you put your little tea bags in there. And it's Raymond Silver Plate Made in England is what it is. And I'm going to start this at 10. Hold on. It has a little spoon. This one doesn't have a spoon. This one does not have a spoon. So that's a reject. This one here. I'm going to start it at 10. If anybody is interested in this. Raymond. R A I M O N, a silver plate made in England. <clears throat> oh, wonderful, Robin. How about you, darling? Is anybody interested in this little treasure? I'm sure it's vintage and it comes with the spoon. Okay. How about. For a $10 start, I offer two with spoons. Oh, Turtle Trader came in at 10. All right, so what, this is what I'm going to do. Two of them have spoons. One of them does not have a spoon. So there's three total. Two with spoons, one without a spoon. $10 start. All right, we have 12 now from Joanne Young. <clears throat> so you get three all together. Two with, one without. 14 from Harley Kitten. Mr. Turtle Trady, well, Susan's going to come in at 19. I'll give you another show. Yeah. 
I will, Tammy. Promise. One from Turtle Trader. I know what happened with your last batch that didn't come from me. It looks like it's got a blue glass interior, doesn't it? Should I open one? Let's open the one that doesn't have the spoon and take a peek at 23 it. 23 from Susan Arrington. And where do you think you're going, Westside Gary? Keep tramping. Okay, nope, this one has a spoon. Well, you, if you're a reseller, you're going to have to unwrap it anyways. <clears throat> Want to know if they all say tea. Yeah. 25 from Joanne. Yeah, they all say tea. I'm going to unwrap this one that doesn't have the spoon on it. The spoon is missing. Oh, yeah. It's blue, but it's plastic. It's not glass, which is good. You can see the blue coming through it. It almost has like an Asian look about it, doesn't it? Yes, the lettering. The lettering? Joanne for 25. One, two, three. <clears throat> Let's do no. it. <laughs> Ooh, uh, <laughs> I wants to know if that's deodorant behind you. <laughs> Where is that? She writes, is that deodorant in the back? Looks like the kind Don wears. <laughs> what is that? The soda cans. <laughs> oh, the soda cans. Yeah, those are salt. Susan is out. out. Three total. I have a coffee container that looks like that. Do you, Brenda? Carol Ann says the lava lamp looks like a science experiment, doesn't it? Look at it. <clears throat> it's starting to disconnect. You see it? Yeah, Cheryl says it's a, like a, a, from the movie Avatar. I love it. Okay. Let's sell it, sell it, sell it. All right. We're sold to Joanne for 25 All right, Joanne. Thank you so much, Joanne Young. Joanne. Thank you so much, Oops. Joanne Young. Yes, Joanne Young. Okay, I just turned on my YouTube. I, look at that. Out of Joanne. all the buttons I could have picked, I just touched my phone and it turned on my YouTube. All right, Joanne Young, thank you. Um, T, you want me to go again? Yeah, tell them one more thing. Joanne Young for 25 for the three sets of tea. So do I, Julie. Isn't it great? This was a gift. Chris the Goose had this, and I said that I love it. And love you too, Victoria. And what's Robin saying? Deep down, she's thinking, no, I'm not, Robin. Um Christopher Chatworth bought this for me as a gift. So, yeah, it was really special, really awesome. Okay, you ready, Missy? Show one more thing. Show one more thing? Okay. Um, I'm going to do some records. I'm going to do some records with a $10 start. And I don't know when I'm going to stop. How about the James Young Band? And Led Zeppelin. These came out of the estate this weekend. Yep, it's in there. Richard Sanchez, bless you ladies. 2021 will be amazing for both of you. Thank you so much, Richard. Thank you, Moses. You're a sweetheart. Thank you so much for that. Okay, so one, two. This one's pretty awesome. Staying alive. Let me make sure it's in there. Yep. He took care of his records. Hey, Craig, I, I texted you today. I was worried about you. You didn't respond. I hope you're well, sweetheart. Um, so that's three. Look at this flash dance. Is this opened? Let me see if it's opened. Yes, just the plastic is still on it. 
That's one, two, three, four. Um, the Butterfield Blues Band. That's five. Billy Preston is six. Curtis Mainfield is seven. The Carpenters is eight. The Loving Spoonfuls is nine. Cat Stevens is 10. 10 records. 10 records with a $10 start and we're at 12. Woodbine Girls at 12. Does anybody want to come in at 14? Kyle comes in at 14. Flash dance. Was that the best movie ever? I loved that movie. Oh my gosh, it was so good. Staying Alive. Was that the best movie ever? <laughs> and then you got Led Zeppelin. This is a nice lot. Where is Jill, that random girl? She put this lot together. Where is that woman tonight? Oh, Craig, I've sold like three or four of them on here. I come across them. T, do you have any record players right now? Uh, I'm not I'm sure, not to be honest with you. I do, but it's huge, and it's got to go local marketplace because it would cost a fortune to ship. It's one of those vintage... Those old vintage ones. What was what story was I telling you about today? Oh, I was telling you about I was telling T the story about speaking um, Sicilian, how um, it was kind of like shunned uh, for many years. Sicilian, um, like I I was I was born in Sicily, and but my father was Italian. No, I'm not getting sleepy, Cheryl, and. Um, and so when he met my mother, who was a true Sicilian, he said, we're going to raise these kids to speak Italian, not Sicilian. So I understand Sicilian, but I don't speak Sicilian, which is kind of weird, right? But I'm fluent in Italian. And um, so I was telling T how for years, like, like probably the 70s and 80s, it was looked at as kind of being like, like ghetto talk, like, like, like nobody, like none of the young kids like embraced the true Sicilian language. Like, so it was becoming a lost art. So now it's like, it's like everything else. Like now it's become popular again, where people are wanting to speak Sicilian and they're wanting to learn like the younger generation wants to learn from their elders how to speak Sicilian because it's, it's an art to speak Sicilian. Michael, I'm not even going to answer that question. Okay. I'm not just delete it. Just delete your own comment <laughs> right now. Take it out of my chat right now, Michael. <laughs> Anyways, I was telling T it's just kind of like, okay. Like sixties and seventies stuff. Like if we had looked at that stuff, like in the nineties or even in the eighties, we would have been like, that stuff is so gross. Like, what were we thinking? Like, that is like so yucky, like that style and just like the Sicilian language. <clears throat> but now we're looking at it and we're like, oh my gosh, that is so cool. Like we love looking at vintage things, you know, it's like funny how things come around, you know, it's, it's really amazing how things always come around. They just always come around. Mr. Turtle Trader is at 44. Thank you, Mr. Turtle Trader. Who else is betting? I'm not even paying attention, Mama G. Kyle Elliott. Oh, Kyle, thank you. Thank you. Sorry, I'm going on. I'm on my Michael, Michael says, I'm from Philly and we fight over it all the time. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. No. Unless you're going to put gravy on your, on your 
pizza sauce, pizza. Yeah, pizza. Do you put gravy on your pizza? What do you put on your pizza? Ranch. <laughs> <laughs> How did that come from? Some ranch. Do. Yeah, some people do. <sighs> right. Oh, she says it's good. My daughter yelled out, it's good. I haven't tried it. I'll have to try it. Okay, Victoria has yelled at you three times telling you you could bring her that record player next week or something. Oh, when I come up to Jacksonville? Yeah. And oh. she's like, just let me know how much you want for it. So really, it it's really awesome, Victoria. It's really probably needs a needle, but that's you know something you can got you can get on eBay really easily. Okay, I'll shoot you a picture of it before I, I load it up. And I'm hoping, I hope I can go to Jacksonville. It's it's really all gonna depend. I mean, to be honest with you, there you are, Jill. Hi, honey. I was hey, just talking about. I was just holding up the record album um, set that you put together. And I'm like, where is that random girl? Hey, Jingle Meow. It all depends on finances. We'll see how well we do this week because she's been invited to go. It's her first tournament of the year. And she's been invited to go with another family, like to split the expenses. But I really want to go. I want to go so bad. Um. I do not like Camille's pizza at all, to be honest with you. Mm -mm. If we get pizza, it's at Giovanni's. Yeah, it's at Giovanni's pizza. Um, I don't like Camille's. I know the family. Um, sell it, Kyle says. Sell it, sell it, sell it. Is Kyle the high bidder? Is Mr. Turtle Trader out? No, Turtle Trade is winning. Oh, that's Kyle's way of saying out. Oh, 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 okay. I thought he meant sell it because he was the high bidder and he wanted me to close on it. Mr. Turtle Trader gets it for $44. Oh, delish. No, 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 Wonder Woman. No, no. He's saying that because I didn't see him say out because I was laughing about the ranch. Um, yeah, we have a Giovanni's Pizza. It's a nice Italian family from New York. I really like them a lot. Tia, are you sitting on the floor? <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> what were you doing? I'm not. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm reading. I'm doing whatever. Are you, are you that T word? I'm always that T word. <laughs> I just don't say it like you do constantly. <laughs> All right. 2007, 2017, Def Leppard, Poison, Side. North American Tour, $10 start, and it's a large. Hmm. <clears throat> These are hot, you guys. Super, super hot. That's all that my kids wear is concert t-shirts. Woodbine Girl comes in at 12. Hi, Pamela. Welcome in. Janine comes in at 14. Size is large, Richard. Definitely my band back in the day, says Jingle Meow. 16 to Susan Arrington. Thank you, Susan. Now you're back. 18 to Lisa. Hello, Lisa. Welcome in. Good to see you. Wow, 135 of you in the chat this evening. Thank you so Thank much. You guys. I feel so blessed to have all of you here. All right, let's stop the bidding with Janine's 20. I have nine large. Janine gets the first one. If you want one, put 20 in the chat. You got this tea? Yo, you need me to write it down. I have it. All right, we're going to be sold to Janine, sold to Mama G.
sold to Lisa. Lisa Schoenberger. I have to make sure we have yes. some Lisa's now. How you doing, Lisa Schoenberger? Thank you, honey. Sold to Jill. Sold to Wonder Woman. Did I miss anybody that was wanting one? Donna, oh, do you want to answer that? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. What was the question? Are there any DVDs tonight? Oh, yes, yes, yes. I was just about to say it. So we talked about it today. And uh, T and I are going to have on my channel Friday night, uh, we are going to have um, movie night. Uh, movie night. Yeah, I'm, th I'm, I'm hesitating because, um, yeah, Friday night. If I go to the tournament, I have to leave Saturday morning. No, that's not this week. Yes, it is. I thought you said it was next week. Oh, it's next weekend. It's next weekend. Oh, wow. You're right. Yeah. Oh, you're, right. you're right. You're right. So I have this. I have all next week yeah. to, be able to. Okay. All right. Yeah. You guys. All right. You guys going to buy stuff from me. <laughs> yeah. Kathy, I got your travel box and June bug. I got your box too. Maybe I can open those live tea. I can. Kathy, did you want me to open yours live? I don't know. I know June bug said to open it live. Okay. Let me go back to Friday night. Friday night. We're having, um, movie night on uh, my channel starting no victoria i'm not <laughs> we're having movie night on my channel at nine o'clock and we are going to do some movie trivia and we are going to be giving away some free movies and most of the night is going to consist of movie stuff so movies dvds uh dvd series um, I have some signed movie star um, photographs. T has some signed movie star photographs. We have some unopened VHSs. What else did we talk about that we have? We have movie posters. Movie posters. Movie posters. Um, yeah, anything that's around movies, television. I even have some signed TV, um, like the cast of... Uh, Law and Order. I think I have Sam Waterston and a bunch of people from Hill Street Blues or NYPD and stuff like that. I'll bring. They're going to be a little tough to ship, but I'll bring them if you guys are interested. They're all signed with COAs. Um, oh, this is so nice. Did you see Broken Arrow? What she said, Mama G? Yes, uh, I did. I was waiting for you guys to stop talking so I could say something. Okay. Thank you, Amber. Thank you, Amber. And T, did you count them all as a different lot? Because no. I didn't. No, okay. I just made them five. We have five, right? So Correct. We have four or four left if anybody else wants one. Okay, Kathy's Corner. No, it's just for each person to grab a prize and one another and put one back in. Okay, so I will do that tomorrow. I'll open it up. I'll grab a prize and then I'll wrap something else up and I'll put it in there. Um, and I'll ship it to T. Oh, I'm the next one on the list. Well, I mean, why not? Why Sandra not? Gillian, <laughs> why not? Hi, Sandra. Well, All right. sweetheart. All right, we'll we'll end that for now. I still have four more large. If anybody's interested, you can always message me. All right, next one I have is Iron Maiden. Oh, the T-shirt. Jingle Meow said she just came back in. She wants to know, it's a, is it 1992? No, it's their 2017 tour, Jingle Meow, with Poison. It's still awesome. It's their 2017 tour with Poison. North American tour, 2017. The way COVID's going, we'll be lucky to ever see another concert. Janine, we haven't even started the next thing yet. <laughs> she oh, oh, Jill says it comes to me. Oh, I didn't know that it was a schedule to follow. Okay, I'll send it to Jill. Is, is, it, there, is there a schedule? I don't know. Maybe oh. inside the box? I don't know. Okay. okay, Jill, I'll send it to you. 
All right, so the next one, this one is a large, it's Iron Maiden. It is the Book of Souls, North American Tour 2017. And it is special guest. Oh boy, help me with this one. I can't read it. I'm not sure who their special guest is. I'm not really an Iron Maiden person. Hi, so, Carla. Welcome in. Who knows who that special guest was? Ghost? Is that, is that supposed to be Ghost? Oh, yes. The list is in the box. Okay, Kathy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, it's getting worse instead of better. Oh, boy. Um, so this is large. Pixelated? What's getting worse? No, 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 no. COVID. COVID is getting worse. Yeah. And yet, Kathy says it says um, ghost. Yes, Carly, you are. Donna will get you a wrench. Carly, okay, Carla, thank you, sweetheart. Thank you for being here. Thank you for... Um... Okay, Mimi resale starts at 10. Janine comes in at 12. It's a large. That's awesome. Yeah, the graphics are cool, right? <laughs> Yes, Loot Raider, we're doing one-offs right now. We're starting today's $10 Tuesday, so we're starting lots at $10. So it's a nice opportunity if you see something you like and no one else bids on it, you're getting it for $10. Edwin Diaz, welcome, 14. Hey, Sab Edwin. Sabrina Jackson, hi. Hey, Sabrina. Oh, she changed her mind. She didn't want to say hi. She probably saw the mail emoji and took it down. Yes, it Carla, would you like one for 20 on the... um? On the leopard, on the deaf leopard, let me know. Those the ones, Loot Raider, yeah. Uh, the shirt before that was 20. Any women's shirts sleeveless? No, but you could make them sleeveless, <laughs> yeah, right? Loot Raider's in at 18 on this shirt. Sheila, yes, Sheila only is also registered, Donna. Okay, Sheila, thank you, sweetheart. Thank you so much. Thank you to everybody that's new. I really appreciate it. Tell me who you came from. How did you find the channel? Thank you. Snip, snip. Right, snip. Right. <laughs> Mimi Rizal is out. Janine is at 20. All right. Janine seems to know where the prices of everything are. Let's stop this one at 20 and let's do the same thing. We'll sell these all for 20 a piece. And Janine gets the first one on this. Loot Raider came in at 22. Nope, Loot Raider, you just saved $2. You can have $20, Loot Raider. Iron Maiden, $20. Sheila says she came over from Bolo Buddies. Thank you, Bolo Buddies. Thank you, Bolo Buddies. Welcome, Sheila. Thank you, honey. T, how many did you say you had of the Iron Maiden? Oh, you know what? That's a good question. I don't have a lot. She has three left. She has three left. Um, oh, oh, of this one. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, five in total. And Janine, Loot Raider, and Joy Munkin that I can see so far. Right. They're from the concert, Jingle Meow. They're not repos. Yeah, they're, they're concert tees. They're just newer concerts. This was the two thousand. The Iron Maiden was the two thousand and seventeen North American tour, the Book of Souls, and the um, Def Leppard was with Poison in two thousand. Oh, Carla, thank you. I'll have to thank Cap for that. Thank you so much. She came over from the Nurse Flipper. Thank you. Oh, nice. Okay, so we have Iron Maiden to Janine, Loot Raider, and Joy. Did I miss anybody? Lisa. Lisa, Lisa wants one. Murder? Okay, yep. thank you. Thank you, guys. And Turtle Trader. Mr. Turtle Trader will take one as well. Okay. That's it. Okay. That's the whole lot. Now I got one more. Oh, you do? I had five total. Unless I missed somebody. Oh, no, then that's it. Yes, that's I'm, it. Right. That's it. You right. did five. Yeah. Yes, you did. Raider, did you want one of the poison deaf leopard ones as well for 20?
Yes, it's a large as well. All right, the next one that I have is one size of this. And I wish I had more. I don't. I wish I had more, but I don't. Uh, so there's one 2X, and it is $10 start. The creative genius of Pink Floyd, Roger Waters, U.S. plus them, 2017 tour. And this one is a 2X. That is awesome. It's a big one. Yeah. Woodbine Girl comes in at 20. Janine is at 114, but I'm sure she means $14. <laughs> I'm like, oh, awesome, Janine. Sold. T. Yes, honey. I also need you to look in the private chat because I've got a couple of a Def Leopard, two Def Leopards sold. Okay. Thank you. Twenty-two to Janine. Lou Raider, I think there's two more Def Leopards left. It was nine all together, Mama G. No, you said ten. No, on the Def Leopard there was nine. Got Janine, me, Lisa, Jill, Wonder Woman, Lou Raider. And Sheila. I've got two left for nine. Yeah, nine. Nine. I just double checked. Nine. All right. We're going to call to Janine on this. It's awesome, Janine. Hi, Donna. Sheila is a member of Republic of Streamers. She's a moderator on Mr. On Demand's channel. She's also a very close family of family. Please, can you give her a wrench? We did give her a wrench, and I also sold her a Def Leppard shirt. Who did we sell the Def Leppard shirt to? Um, Sheila. Mr. Secret Agent Man was saying um, Republic of Streamers. She's a moderator. I thought Republic of Streamers. I thought you sent me a message about Republic of Streamers. No, that's a different Sheila, I think. I think Sheila Olney is. Okay. I think that's a different Sheila. Didn't you send me a message about Republic of Streamers, Mr. Secret Agent Man? Joy Munkin is lagging. She's at 20. I think that's a different Sheila, to be honest with you. I could look again. You have this as lot six. I have this as lot six, yes. Hey, Talbert's mom. Hey, Talbert's mom. Yeah, it's a different Sheila. But... Sorry, Sheila. <laughs> I'm not related to anyone. Well, you're part of our family now, Sheila. Welcome. <laughs> sergeant Spork, what happened to your sergeant? Sergeant Spork. You got rid of your sergeant? Hi, Talbot. Maybe, maybe, maybe Mrs. Spork is cracking the whip, and now he has to be Mr. Spork. <laughs> oh, no. Hey, Lucas D. Hi, Lucas D. What's the Def, Def Leopard thing? It's a t-shirt it's, it's a shirt okay wait a minute loot raider has just bought another of the deaf leopards okay. i have one left all right so there's one more large deaf leopard left all right so loot raider's getting two of them correct okay i need you to look in the private chat okay and then we've just sold the 2XT to Janine. Okay. 
Thank you, Janine. Hello, Mr. Buys a lot. Brian, Brian's here. Brian, 2K, baby. <laughs> All right, Donna, you're good to go. Are you sure you can keep going? They're size large. We got more shirts. Keep going with the shirts. You're on a roll. Um, no, Lucas, I don't have extra large in the ones that I showed, but I have an extra large coming up in this one if anybody's interested. Okay, we've got the last Death Leopard sold. Okay. To rise up. Rise up, okay. Oh, uh, thank you, Mr. Buys a lot. Thank you so much. Yep, you did say that. Thank you, Brian. Yeah, so I'm going to drop a video, and everybody's got to go to the video, watch it, like it, make a comment, and you'll be entered to win in my 2K giveaway. All right, rise up, Def Leppard. All right. Chelsea, and is anybody else having trouble streaming YouTube on their TV tonight? Hmm. All right, and Janine won the Pink Floyd. And let's see, is anybody interested in a Jay-Z? Jay-Z tour. Size. Extra large. Extra large on this one. And this is Gildan, heavy cotton. $10 start. Hey, Paul. Vintage Treasures is in the house. Good to Hi, see Paul. you. Hi, Paul. I love that it has the barcode on top. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I don't know. I guess that has something to do with his tour. I don't know. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I love it. It might be the barcode. The barcode or something. I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't follow Jay-Z, so I don't know. Carla Zana, Carla Zana came in at 10. American Tide is American Tide um registered. I don't know. No, I don't think so. They unless they printed it recently. I'll take a quick look. Okay, we're at ten dollars with Carla. Yes, we're American Tide has registered. Okay, thank you, American Tide. Welcome, American Tide. welcome to the family. Got Brian at fifteen. Uh, no, have not seen Kalina Sos. Now that you mention it, she has oh, not. Oh yeah, Kalina has not been around. No. Joy came in. Came came come in. Came in at seventeen. Thank you, Joy. Hello. Good night, Victoria, honey. Victoria, before you go to bed, could you drop your channel in the chat? Guys, if you're not following Victoria in the morning at 730 and you're up and you need a place to go, go ahead and follow Victoria over to her channel, 730 a.m. Eastern time. If you guys are up and having coffee, I don't know, Victoria, I must I thought I was subscribed. I was looking for you all over this morning. Could not find you. <clears throat> Please drop your link in the chat. I got to double check. I think YouTube may have unsubscribed to me. I don't know. I could not find it for the. What the hell is 7.30 a.m.? Well, some of us are up that early, Talbert's mom. All right. <laughs> Who are we selling this to? 
Thank you, Victoria. Mama G, who are we selling this to, honey? Joy? Joy, it's seven. Yeah, Joy Munkin, sorry. All right. All right, four more extra large for 17 on the Jay-Z, if anybody's interested. Four more Jay-Z at 17. So if anybody wants one for 17. I don't think T sleeps. These days, it's tough. These days, it is tough. It's going to be tough for the next month or two, for sure. All right, so Joy Munkin, Jay-Z, $17. Thank you, Joy. Anybody else want a Jay-Z for $17? Willow, she hasn't dropped that video yet. No. When are you going to do that? When we go off. Thank you, Mr. Turtle Trader. Wow, 140 of you in the chat this evening. Awesome. You guys, don't forget to go over and give the video a thumbs up, please. Those are good numbers for a small channel. All right, Donna, back to you, honey. Okay. Thank you for everyone that's coming over. I can see the ticker going up on the thumbs up. Thank you so much. Okay. So, um, Oh, good, Amy. I'm so happy. Awesome. $10 start. I have more of that stuff. I'll bring for another $10 Tuesday. Kind of got sidetracked with the new stuff. <laughs> this is all jewelry making stuff. $10 start. Crafts. This is how big the jar is. It's my jewelry jar. So it's just a surprise jar of crafts. Well, of course you did uh, Bolo Buddies because you, my dear, are a goody two-shoes. <laughs> Miss Goody Two-Shoes is in a 12. <laughs> <laughs> Sabrina's in for 14. So there's just a bunch of, um, you know, like, uh, like these are all hearts, just a whole bunch of the same thing. So I guess you could make like earrings out of them. And then there's lots of these sort of things where they're like, you know, on, um, you know, the beads on the things that you would buy, like the pre-beaded stuff. 24 now from Willow. Twenty six from Sabrina. These are like the clasps to make. Are those the jewelry? Yeah, the magnet clasps. That's nice. So you even have that in there. So it's just all jewelry making stuff. Twenty eight from Willow. Willow loves her jewelry making stuff. What is that? Oh, those are, are those pin backs, you guys, to make pins? It looks like it, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, they look like, like 30 now from Sabrina Jackson. If you made your own pins. Carla, so we never include the jar. The jar is not included, honey. So that's nice. It's got, like, right out of the gate, you've got stuff in here that you can make um, brooches. You can make necklaces. Oh, look what else it has. Those are earring backs. See them? Oh, yeah. To make earrings. Oh, and you know what else is in here? Look, I remember putting it in there. A little pair of jeweler's um, pliers. So, nice assortment. Oh, 
All right, let's see where we're at. Thirty to Sabrina. Anybody else going? Good night, Richard, honey. Good night. Thank you again. Thanks for being here. Thank you so much, Richard. Thank you for the super chat, honey. He's got an early start tomorrow. Okay, if you have time, stop in and have coffee with us on T's channel at ten. We'll be on. We'll have coffee and then we'll roll right into a. Um, I was gonna say we'll roll right into a concert. <laughs> Cool. <laughs> Those concert t-shirts have gotten to me. We're going to roll right in. Happy New Year. Hi, Shane. I haven't seen you. Thanks for coming in. All right. Did we sell it? We Just are going to be sold. Jackson. Yes, Jingle Mio. For $30. For the jewelry making. Hey, Glenn. Happy New Year to you. I don't think I've seen you in the new year. Oh, those were those cups. Okay. I have this Elvis. I'm going to leave you two alone for two minutes. I have to step away. Okay. So this is, it's a numbered collectible, but I'll tell you what. So it looks like the original price on this was $50.99. It's not a record though. It's a $10 start. What it is, is, and these are trending right now, believe it or not. I can't believe how things come around, but you get a picture of Elvis in here. And then they're all cassettes. Look at how beautiful this picture of Elvis is. You're so beautiful. And you get six cassettes in here. Tape cassettes. Right? He's dreamy. Look at him. So beautiful. He was so young in this picture do you trader okay <laughs> <laughs> mr turtle trader <laughs> all right we've got ruth at 20 are we gonna close it Um, so Craig, we are doing, um, DVDs on Friday night, Friday night. We're doing DVDs. I know, I know, I know, I know. I'll put the, I'll put the cover on it. <laughs> Ruth Bond comes in at 30. All right. And Jingle Meow is out. Yeah, Friday night we're having movie night. We're going to be doing all movie-related things. We're going to do DVDs. We're going to do um, pictures. We're going to do VHSs. We're going to do uh, movie posters. Everything that's uh, movie-related. Ruth Bond is in at 40. Just that alone is so pretty. Wouldn't that be pretty just framed? Just that? I love that. Concession stand, right? We're going to need one. Ruth is at 40. <laughs> no, you're good, Mr. Turtle Trader. Just a little wild. Just a little wild side coming out on you. <laughs> All right. Agent Stereo comes in at 42. Ruth, let us know. Ruth is out. Okay, Mr. Secret Agent Man is in at $42. We're going to call it down. 
Oh, it also comes with this. Um, I forgot to show you the book. Or is it a poster? I don't even know what it is. Let's see. This came out of it, too. Oh, it's a book. It's a book. Well, not a book, but like, a you know, an insert with all that going on in there. Donna, please, can you give... BBB is bankrupt. Elvis shares the same birthday as me. Really, Susan Arrington? That's awesome. That's a great trivia question. All right, are we sold? Lot number six. Please, can you give to Sheila... P-L-O-R-D-E. What's that? Someone that's watching, I guess that's from overseas. With, I don't know. But there's going to be the shipping that goes with that that's going to have to be included. Um... Is she in the... And I just... Huh? I is think she, so. Is she registered? Is she in the chat? No. Or? Um, okay. And so how do we want to handle this, T? Secret Agent Man um, won this for $40, $42. What is it? And he wants to send it to someone who I think isn't, it's a record. It's a cassettes. And he wants to send it to someone who I guess is in the chat, but then I don't know if Sheila is registered. Is this the same Sheila nonsense again? No, yeah. this is a, yeah. Sheila Oxley bought your shirt. This is the Sheila he's, he's trying to buy for. Okay, I'll deal with this. Ruth Bond was the backup bidder? Yes. Okay. All right. Yeah, not you, Sheila. Not you, it. Sheila only. Yeah, okay. All right. Did we even hear from the Sheila person? No, 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 no. Just, um, Tia, are you ready? I'm going to put you back on. Give me two seconds. Okay. I just came back with a ton well, of stuff. Well, she takes two seconds. I'm going to do this. Um, where's that box here? I'm going to do this. This is going to be a $10 start. This is from my private stock, you guys. You've got Christian Dior. This one here, I have not looked up. $10 start. And then three coins in the fountain perfume by Vivian. It says New York. You get three perfumes, $10 start. Three beautiful designer perfumes. We got June Bug at the high bid of 22. Tammy comes in at 25. I don't know which one this one is. You're going to have to look it up, try to find what it, there's something on it, but I, I don't know what it is. Mimi's out. June is at 27. Mm 
How do you like the display, you guys? The old box with the old perfumes. <laughs> Not too shabby, right? Nice. Junebug is out. Tammy's at 35. Anybody else want to grab up this deal? It's a great deal for these three perfumes. I didn't even look them up, but I just know that vintage perfume sells for a lot of money. Is the presentation box for sale? Oh, Sergeant Spork, you changed your name for me. <laughs> Sergeant Spork, you're going to want what's in the presentation box. You're going to love what's in the presentation box. And I was going to bring it up for auction. So I'll, I'll bring it up. Hey, are you making dinner or something? <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Three bottles. Oh, I'm such a mess here. Fine. Vintage. I, I, I feel another dibble desk coming on by yeah. Thursday. <laughs> Two Tammy for $35. We're going. We're going. We're selling it. We're sold. Sold, sold, sold to Tammy. Okay, this old box. This old box with the working little hinges on it is filled with, let's see how I open it. I had it open. Why isn't it not opening? What am I doing wrong? Is it upside down? Oh, it's upside down. Okay. Jeez, that would have been horrible. Horrible, horrible. This is what's in it. Came out of a storage unit. Oh, wow. And this is what's in it. Huh. It says... Um... Um, I, I don't know what it says. Oh, Grum Backer Finest Pastel Colors for Artist. G R U M B A C M E R. Something like that. Yeah, it's pastels. Yes. It's an old box. It's got its original label here. Okay, G-R-U-M-B-A-C-H-E-R, -E New York, made in the USA. It's very cool. Just the box alone is awesome. So you can see there's bits and pieces and some whole pieces. Very, 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 very loved. It's really awesome. The box itself is beautiful. And it's got these awesome little working hinges. All right. We have 40 from Sergeant Spork. There. The hinges, oops, they do attach. 45 from Susan Arrington. Oh, thank you, Mr. Turtle Trader. I love finding these treasures. Oh, it won't stay, but it does, it does latch. It does latch, but it doesn't, that one's not staying. This one's staying. Yes, very, I mean, I think that this might even be older than vintage, to be honest with you. I think it might be, um, I, I would, I would, I would say antique. <laughs> I wish I could read um, all the stuff that it says there, but you guys will have fun. Whoever wins it to read it. It just needs a good paintbrush, brush it all off, get all the pastels off of it. Okay, Sergeant is at 50. We're going to sell it. Antique. 
Grumbacher's pastels. Nice. Yes. Thank you, Carol Ann. Thank you, honey. 55 to Susan Arrington. Sergeant Spork is out. Thank you, Sergeant Spork. Susan Arrington's at 55. Congratulations. Everybody done and done? Put this right here. Well, that was a great buy. Congratulations. Awesome. Congratulations, Susan. Want me to go again? You have something there? I do. Okay, show it. Show it, show it, show it. Um, all right, how about I show this? It's a large, it's an Under Armour, it's camouflaged, and it's pink. And I'm going to do this as a $10 buy it now. It's a large. It looks kind of small for an, uh, a large, but uh, maybe it's a junior's large. I mean, I'm a large. I mean, it would be, no, I'm not a large. I'm an extra an extra, or double XL. Andrea Baker wants it for $10. Thank you, Andrea. Okay, let's do this for 10. Hold on, let me mark it. Number nine goes to Andrea for $10. Camo and armor. And that was lot number nine, $10 to Andrea. Oh my goodness. The numbers went way down. So maybe somebody went live. Lost like 40 people. Okay, <clears throat> that's going to Andrea's house. All right, I'm going to do another lot of $10 start on the records. We have Jimi Hendrix. And Nights in White Saturn. That's an awesome album, right? Uh huh. The Moody Blues. Jethro Tull. Living in the past. $10 start on this, guys. $10 start. The Moody Blues again. The Moody Blues again. Simon and Garfunkel. All right. Woodbine Girl starts us off at 10. Who's this? Anybody know who that is? Pretty awesome, whoever it is. Let's see if it says it on the album. Oh, hey, it's, Jethro, it's Jethro Tull. Happy New Year, James. Oh, I didn't even see it. Jethro Tull. Thanks, you guys. <laughs> I didn't even see it. Oh, and here's Led Zeppelin. And this is this is the original. These are not remakes, you guys. These are the real deal. Twelve from Mimi Resells. 14 from Woodbine Girl. Yep. These are the real deal. And, um, you know, there's a scratch here. I'm not like Tom Cruise where I, I guarantee I don't listen to the records. You know, I don't 
I don't have time for that. You guys no, are speak of the devil. <laughs> Tom Cruise. Yeah. <laughs> Tom, I don't, I'm not like you, honey. I, I can't guarantee that they come. They're not play graded. They're not play graded. They're not. I haven't played them. I mean, I know Jill looked at them for me. Um, you know, some of them do have a little scratch here and there, but okay. But this is what I have. I have that. Was that Led Zeppelin? Led Zeppelin, I think it was. I don't remember still. Again, Jethro Tell, Simon and Garfunkel. Um, the Moody Blues and the Moody Blues again. And this one's awesome. Jethro Tell living in the past. This is like a book. I'm going to open that up. And this one is the London, the London Festival Orchestra. Nights in white satin. The Moody Blues. And then a Jimi Hendrix. 22 to Kyle Elliott. But I want to open this one up because I want to see what's in here. 24 a four from Woodbine Girl. This is like a, this is like a book. 30 from Tom Cruise. This one's like a book. It's it's, it's pretty amazing. Tom probably knows. He's probably seen this album over and over again. To you it is out. 35 from Woodbine Girl. See, yeah, this has got something on it. It's got something on it, you guys. I don't know. See it? I don't know if that's ruined. You can retract if you want. Look, I don't know if it's moisture from being in that closet. Don't rub your hands. Don't rub your hands. Don't rub your hands. All right. Well, maybe somebody who knows something about records knows how to clean it. They were they were literally sitting. You saw me. Um, get them out of the bottom of a closet. Actually, Jill got them from the bottom of the closet. Not me. I made her crawl <laughs> and get them. Connie Johnson, 42. Woodbine Girl, 42. Your haircut is so amazing. It's like glam v v Veronica like hair. Just gorgeous. Thank you, Talbot's mom. Jill cut it for me. She cut like, oh my gosh, probably six inches off of it. It, felt, it feels so good like when you touch it. And the ends are not like all straggly anymore. Like it's like nice blunt cut. I love the feel of it. It really changes your attitude when you get a good haircut. Like it changes your, like you're not tired anymore. <laughs> T, why are you shaking your head? <laughs> no, it's true. When you get a haircut, it's almost like the tiredness just goes away. Like for a whole year, you figure it's been two years since I had a haircut. So this non-tiredness should last me a year at least. Can we make a bet on that? <laughs> Can we put a wager down on that one? <laughs> it really does. Mimi understands. She understands. She understands. Yeah. The tire just goes away. <laughs> just leaves you. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't know. No. No. I used the word in a sentence, Willow. The non-tired haircut feeling. Yes, James. You understand. <laughs> James, you're going to the wrong hairdresser. You need to go see Jill. <laughs> Andrea. Jill, she's the YouTube hairdresser. I know I need a haircut. <laughs> well, you need to get down here. I know. Robin needs a haircut. <laughs> so, look what she's doing. <laughs> she's tired. She needs a haircut. All right, let's sell this. Connie Johnson. Connie Johnson's going to take it for 40. Thank you. 45. Thank you, Connie Johnson. Lot in a patent to Connie. I should, James, right? Eh, not just not yet. <laughs> just not yet. For what? For what? To come to Florida. Oh, I know. Forget it now with all those storage units she bought. She's never going to get her butt down here. 
Besides, if she leaves New York, they're not going to let her back in. Right? I don't know. Do you want to come on the screen? Yes, ma'am. Okay. <laughs> Bam! Bam! <laughs> All right. I have a lot of CDs here. That's what we have. $10 ship to start. Cindy Lauper. I guess I should check these because I don't Congratulations, know. Connie. Thank you so much for your purchase, honey. Cindy Lauper. Metallica. That's a double one. No, maybe it's a triple one. It's a triple one. Three CDs in that one. Michael Crawford. Oops. What's in there? Soul of Man, Kenny Lattimore. Hannah McEwen. That's a promotional. I was wondering what it said on there. There's a little promotional sticker on there. Bent Fabric Jukebox. He's 2021 tour, right? <laughs> the best of sticks. And just so you guys know, not the, the CDs are in excellent condition, but some of the cases leave a lot to be desired. Like this next one from Happy Roots. Watermelon, chicken, and grits. Source magazine, spin artists to watch in 20. In 2002, featuring the singles Orna and Heads Up. Martha Wainwright. Step Inside This House, Lyle Lovett. Another promotional. And we've got one and two. Double double set DVD. MIA. A little crack there at the back, just so you guys know. Bullworth, the soundtrack featuring Dr. Dre, LL Cool J, Old Dirty Bastards, How Come by Cannabis and I don't know, somebody else there. songs, Placido Domingo and others. Benny Blanco, Some Kind of Heaven. Brazilian Girls. Needs a case. Lay Nash, another promotional, another one that needs a case. Julie Andrews, Broadway, another one that needs a case. So just so you guys know, just so you know. Classic Love, Elton John, Lionel Richie, Luciano Pavarotti. That one does look unplayed. A lot of them look unplayed. Just the cases were not like in the best of condition. But All right, so that's what you got, guys. Shrimp grits in the bomb is the bomb. Anybody else? Are we going to give these to Mimi? Mimi resells. Oh, that's nice, Tom. All right, let's sell to Mimi. Oh. 
Congrats, Mimi. All right. I have a few more of these left. I showed these, I guess, way back before the holidays. But they're yoga pants. There's four different styles. Style one. Style two. Style three and style four. I only have them left in a large. I only have them left in a large. But if you guys, $10, buy it now. $10, buy it now. Large yoga pants. Just put the number in the chat of the style. So that's style number one. That's style number two. Style number three or style number four. Ten dollars each, and just tell me what style number one, two, three, or four. One, two, three, or four. Junebug, I have. You have two pairs coming, just FYI. But tell me what style number if you want another. That would be three. You want one of each, Junebug? Okay. All right. Anyone else? Size large again. One. I have. I have other. I have others. I have multiple quantities. So, but they're just all. Everything that's left now is a large. Everything that's left now is a large. And just put the number in the chat for ten dollars. All right, no other interests. We'll sell four of them to Junebug, and that's it. All right, Junebug, thank you, honey. Okay. All right, let's see if there's any interest in some Yu-Gi-Oh cards. I have some Yu-Gi-Ohs here. And I'll start on these guys. The stack is that big. With a few that are in um, containers. Shriker's in the house. Hello, Shriker. Hey, Shriker. Yes, Shriker, in the corner. You missed lots. <laughs> How are you, honey? All right. So these four are in sleeves. I don't know if there's anything special about these four, but these four are in sleeves. And then you have this large stack of them. I'll try to show you guys any dates on the bottom. Okay, I could do that. Maybe if I get my... <laughs> You're going to need your magnifying glass and it's yeah. going to be on the bottom left, I think. 1996 on that one. Nineteen ninety six on that one. These are the ones in the sleeve, which this one's a ninety five, which I don't even know why it's in a sleeve because there is a big mark at the bottom there. Um, Nineteen ninety six on that one. Nineteen 
96. I'm not checking the dates on all of these, just so you know. <laughs> I'm just checking. It looks like most of them are 96. That's what I think. Yep, 96. I'll check a few more. And we'll just... 96. 96. 96. And then I'll just show you the ones that I'm looking at. 96. Ninety-six. Ninety-six. Hi, Denali. Oh my God, it's eleven eleven already. Oh my goodness. Ninety-six. Thank you, everyone. June bugs at sixteen. Yeah, so, so far, all of these are a 96. I'll show them. And I have no idea where the Band-Aids came from. It was supposed to be a heart. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's crazy. That was like I typed something the other day. Oh, yeah, when I was doing... When I was doing it the other night, the Denali, instead of it showing, it it kept saying the words Denali instead of actually showing Denali. It was weird. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. Somebody is asking to see the holographic ones again, but they're not going to get a close-up enough shot of what they're looking at. And I don't know that they're... Are they holographic? Is that why they're in the sleeves? If they're Kelly. shiny. Hey, Kelly. Garden finds is in the house. Abraham, welcome. Is that why they're in the sleeve, I guess? I don't know. There might be some not in the sleeve. I don't know. All right. So that's all you've seen so far. And this is what's still here. Mimi said, speaking of which, I saw a Denali today. They are huge. Yes. My truck is very big. See, this is a, this looks like this is holographic, but it's not in a sleeve. can see if I can find any more holographic ones, if that's what you guys want to see more of. I think this one is, I think, yeah, well, it looks like it is. Maybe, I don't know, maybe not. My eyes are 100%. Is this like the other day? Is there going to be like 100 or 200 cards? It's probably 300. It's probably right. 300. The other day was 300, and I think this stack is at least the same, if not bigger. But I can do a little estimate. I found another one in a sleeve. just to give you some kind of idea. I mean, it's not going to be exact because I'm not going to count. I'm going to count the stack of 40, which I just did, and I'm going to kind of compare them to what's here. 
so it'll be close. It's not going to be exact. So yeah, 40, 40, 40. Forty. Forty. All right. So it will definitely be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, it's like almost three hundred. It's probably just around three hundred cards. Just around 300 cards, you know, give or take 10 or so. And most of them, if not all of them, say 1996 on them because I looked at a few more. Um, so, yeah. Oh, I'm, I'm lying. It's more than 300. I was counting 20 times. I think it, oh, I think it's well over 300, actually. It's definitely, let's just call it 300, and if it's more, you guys got a bonus for sure. It's definitely, it's definitely 300 and maybe more. Because I did 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Yeah, yeah, it's 300. It's 300 cards, yeah. All right, Tammy's out. We have Junebug in at 44. Kyle's in at 46. Yu-Gi-Oh! And guys, just a reminder, I am going to be releasing a video... For 2,000 subscribers, please go like, comment, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Everyone who comments in that video will be entered to win in my 2,000 giveaway drawing. You'll have until 10 a.m. Saturday morning to watch and comment on the video. And um, we'll do the giveaway of coffee on Saturday. All right, we're going to sell it to Kyle. Junebug's out. And we're going to do coffee with one off Wednesday tomorrow morning at 10 a.m. 10 to 1 tomorrow. All right, Kyle Elliott. Thank you, Kyle. Oh, Mimi, she hasn't released the video yet. She's are you, oh, yeah. you going to do it after we're off? Um, I'm going to do it after. I didn't even make it yet, so I'm going to do it. It's, it'll be like 10 minutes. You, it won't be long to watch. And it's just, I'm just going to release it. I'm not doing it as a premiere or anything. So make sure you have the bell notifications on for the channel so you know when it's released. All right, Donna, you're up, honey. Okay. All right, you guys. I have, I think it's a vintage Victoria's Secret lot. I'm not sure if it's vintage or if it's just from a few years ago. It looks kind of old to me. It's medium. It's going to be a $10 start. This is what you get. Some of these are bolos. I know that some of Victoria's Secret stuff is bolos. Um, did Victoria's Secret go out of business? Yes. I yes. I think that pink stuff is is what that is very highly. The pink is sought after. Yeah, I think so too. This one's large and it says Michigan on it. And look at how pretty the back is. $10 start on this. Nice. I'm surprised your daughters haven't confiscated that up. <laughs> I haven't seen it. Quick, hide it. Get a bag. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> and so four pieces total. And here's another pink. And it's another large. And this one has all that bling bling. It's a hoodie. And then it has it on the sleeve. Nice. Jill would like to see the tags, please. Jill? 
Julie's in for 20. There's that tag. There's that tag. Twenty two from Abraham. There's that tag. And whoops. There's that tag. Twenty four to Julie. Yeah, Julie Morris, I did see. She was in for something. I don't remember. Maybe coffee over the weekend. Pretty awesome. 26 from Abraham. Twenty eight from Julie. Thank you. This looks like it's never been worn. It's brand new. Hey, Jade Moon. Hi, Jade. All right, Abraham's out. Julie's at 28. Anybody else? Or should we call it? 30 to Jill. This is the best one. Well, in my opinion. Julie begs to differ. She likes the Michigan one. <laughs> uh, <laughs> 32 to Julie. Can't believe Victoria's Secret went out of business. Right. 34 from Jill. God, they were like, oh, I remember standing in line waiting to pay for stuff when the girls were like young teens. That's all they wore is Victoria's Secret from head to toe. It's all they wanted. It was 36 from Julie. Pink, pink, pink. That's all they wanted. Hey, Kelly. All right, Jill is out. We're going to call it to Julie at 36. All right, Julie. Julie Schwartz. Oh, she said my niece will flip when I send that to her. Nice. Oh, awesome. Do you want me to send it to her? Julie? They're, um, they're clean. There's no smell, even though they came out of a storage unit. There's absolutely no smell to them. They're perfectly clean. So if you want me to send them directly to your niece, it's up to you. All right, Julie Schwartz. All right, sold to Julie. Congratulations, Julie. Oh, uh, okay. All right. All righty. Let me just mark this to Julie. That's lot number 11, $36 for the pink. 
All right. Wrap this up. All right. This next one's going to be another $10 start. And you're going to get, this is a beautiful sweater. It's a lucky brand. And it's a size extra large. And it's a kind of gunmetal with a gold thread running through it. And it has this kind of like little extra undershirt that hangs down below it. So you're going to get that. And then you're going to get this Banana Republic. And it's a gray, nice gray sweater. This is like going shopping at the thrift shop, you guys. $10 start. You're going to get that. And then you're going to get another Banana Republic. And it's a size medium. And it's a gray. It's nice gray sweater. That's three. And then the fourth item is this. I actually tried this on because I loved it. It's J Joan Vaz, size large. Joan Vaz. And it's a very, very pretty. It's got... It's got pockets in the front and it's a really pretty ribbed on the bottom and then it's just a nice cotton and a ribbed collar and it's a cardigan it's a cardigan and it's Joan Vaz so Joan Vaz size large banana republic I would say unisex size medium banana republic again Size large, I would say it's also um, unisex. And then this really pretty lucky brand, a size extra large. Four pieces. Four pieces of designer clothes. $10 start. We have Andrea Baker for $10. Anybody else? This is lot number 12. Hey, Anita. Hi, honey. <laughs> Jill. Jill and I had a busy weekend. All right, let's close it to Andrea for $10. All right, we're going to go. We a deal for Andrea. She deserves it. Thank you, Andrea. Going once. Claudia comes in at 12. Hey, Wes. Andrea comes in at 14. Andrea, I'm surprised you didn't bid on that um, pink set I just showed. I don't know if you were here. Dawn is rubbing off on me, Willow. <laughs> You guys, Jill was incredible this weekend. I have to tell you, like she, I said this in my other live, I, she was incredible. Like I forgot my phone upstairs in the condo and we had just gone down, we had just gotten all the way downstairs and it was a hike, like from the parking lot all the way up to the condo. And I was like, <coughs> oh darn it, I forgot my phone. And Jill was like, give me the keys, I'll go get it for you. Oh my gosh, she's unbelievable. She like really took good care of me this weekend. She was such a good friend. Okay, so who got it? 
Claudia. Claudia. Harlow. Got it for $16 for the four pieces of clothing. Lot number 12. Lot number 12 for $16 to Claudia Harlow. Claudia, do I have something else for you or did I ship it out already? I don't remember. Let me know in the chat if you remember if I have something else for you or not. I know, Rachel, you're a good friend. Thank you for helping me so, so much this weekend. And I still have the keys, Jill, and I did not have a chance to go back over there, and he hasn't called me for the keys. So I still have the keys to the condo to go get those nurses' uniforms, and I think I'm going to grab, I think I'm going to take a lot of those books. We And I have to look inside the books. You shipped three today. I did to you. Look at I don't even I don't even know what I shipped and what I didn't ship. Isn't that crazy? She probably got all the tracking numbers. All right, honey. Well, we'll wait until that gets up to thirty dollars. Maybe between the rest of tonight and tomorrow, it will get up to thirty dollars, and I can ship it out. I know, right, Tammy? Dolores, Dolores actually was going to come and help, and I missed her message, and she wanted the address, and she was going to come over. She couldn't help us on Saturday, but she sent me a message on Sunday that she could get, come over and help us, and I, I really, I didn't, like, look at my phone because we were just so busy, so, but it would have been fun to have Dolores there. I miss her so much. Okay, this is called Cow Parade. Cow Parade. This came out of that woman's unit. I know nothing about it, but I'll show it to you. It is oh so funky. I don't know if it's worth anything. Um, I haven't looked it up. You guys can tell me if it's something or not something, but that's what it's called. Cow Parade. And look at this. So, um, look at it. It looks like he's listening to like an iPhone or something. Kathy jumps in at 30. Thank you, Kathy. And he comes complete with the box. Got the whole thing. I've heard of these. Hi, Anita. Anita, did you get my message today, honey? I sent you a message. I don't know if you got it. It's numbered. It's 2007. All right. Looks like KK is going to get it at 30 unless anybody else wants to come in. We'll give it to KK. There is several different ones. Oh, is there? No, I sent it to your phone, Anita. I texted you. Moo, Cheryl says. <laughs> All right. That is lot number 13. It's a famous artist. Oh, I didn't know. All right. It's KK for the cow. It's like the painted horse collection, is it? I don't know. Lot number 13 for $30. 1521. All right. And off that goes. All right. Let's do let's do another lot of clothing. What else do I have that's right here? I have some stuff out there I can grab. Um Let's do another lot of clothing. Let's see. This one here is called English Laundry. It's a men's shirt, and it has the pretty, you know, cuffs, um, fancy kind of collar. Okay, so you get that. 
Ten dollars start. I know this actually came out of a rich man's unit. I know this name. I've sold it before. Um, it's pretty sought after. Men's shirt, one hundred percent cotton. You get that. So this is. I would call this a reseller lot. And this one is a lucky brand, and it's a size medium. This is a probably nice bread and butter. My daughter would have snagged this up if she saw it. It's got kind of like the waterfall back. It's really cute. She would want that. And next is this sweater. And it is, I don't know this name, Vervi Ami, size extra large. And it's another really pretty black cardigan. And it's got like this nice, can you see the, you can see the lamp behind it. It's kind of like, um, got a nice pattern on it and the top of it too. And it's just a really pretty black sweater, really soft very, very soft, very pretty. Extra large. This one is the Lucky brand. Here's that really nice men's shirt made in the USA. And then this men's shirt. They're asking for the sizes on all of them. Did they didn't see them when I held them up. This one is 100% linen, and it is, oh, look at it. It's even got the name on the bottom. This is a fancy shirt, English laundry. 100% um, <clears throat> linen. I don't see a size on this. Isn't that weird? Oh, eight, no, six, fifth, was it 16 or 15? 16 and a half, 34, 35 on this one, on this fancy one. And then this one is size extra large on that one. And then the Lucky Brand one is a size medium for the Lucky Brand. And then this beautiful women's sweater is a size extra large. Love this. So pretty. You're welcome, Mr. Turtle Trader. Thank you. Andrea is 18. This is lot number 14. Four pieces of clothing. And Schreiker comes in at 20. Lot number 14. Twenty-two to Andrea. Thank you, Andrea. This is this is a nice men's shirt, but this one here, my gosh, oh so fancy, right? Oh so fancy. And it's got the British flag on it too. There. English Laundry. Christopher Wicks. Christopher Wicks is the name on it. Andrea's in at 26. Schreiker is out. We're going to give it to Andrea. Thank you, Andrea. I was just thinking to myself, I talked to Andrea today after work briefly and she, you know, she was driving home from work and she had worked all day and she was going to get something to eat. And, and I was just thinking to myself just now, it must, it must be so nice, Andrea, like to just sit at home, like at night, like I know T used to do the same thing and like not have to worry about spending your Saturday, like going out thrifting for clothes to find, to supplement your income, to sell on eBay, where you can like be lying in bed right now and just, you know, buying your inventory and have it delivered right to the house, you know, and, and, um, yeah. 
I mean, when I was reselling, if I had that, if, if somebody was doing what I'm doing now on YouTube and I had the opportunity to like shop from home and just be able to stay home and not have to spend hours and hours like searching for, you know, some nice designer clothes to put, um, Oh, good, Anita. Yeah. And I sent it. I sent it. And then you get to list all day on Saturday and not have to waste a whole day like out thrifting, going to three different. To me, that was like the worst. Like trying, I mean, some people love it. Some people love the hunt. But for me, it was like the worst trying to find before I went back to buying storage units and stuff, like having to like look for the stuff. And then I'd get home and I'd be so tired and um not want to list you know after being out searching for product all day are you ready t excuse me what were you are you eating mm -hmm. i didn't eat my dinner i'm starving i was eating in between do you want me to keep showing mm -hmm. please okay <laughs> so yeah i know payback's a bitch i know so even back then, <laughs> all right, um, what should I do? What should I do? What should I do? What should I show? Um, okay. It's $10 Tuesday, but I'm going to put a reserve on it. Look what I have. I took all my perfume off the shelf. I'm going to start this at 10, but it's going to cost me like, uh, Probably close to 25 to ship it. So hopefully it will get up that high. We'll see. Okay. The first one is, ooh, Javinci. Dahlia. Devin? Deving? Okay. That one. And here's, so this is a $10 start, you guys. There's that one. There's a Stetson. And for those of you that are looking at this and they're like, why is she selling half used bottles of perfume? Trust me, they sell. They sell. Even if you have a quarter of a bottle, a lot of people buy them even just for the, the bottles themselves. This one is an old spice brand and it doesn't have very much in it. I don't know if I would bother to list that. I don't even know why that's, um, that's in here. I don't know if it's desirable. This one is missing, but don't let that deter you from, from listing it either. This one's London, New York, and Paris. It's called Pure. It's P-I-K Studio Perfume. And it says Poison on it. So I don't know anything about that one. This one here is... Um, Oh, this is cuticle oil. It's cuticle oil. I don't know why that's in there. This one is um, almost empty as well. Look at how much is in there. Like nothing. So you have to look them up and see if they're worth listing. I don't know what this is, but it looks like a bottle of something tea had. T, didn't you have something that looked like this? That's Elizabeth Arden. Is it? Yes. Okay, Elizabeth Arden. Here's a vintage English leather. Here is some sort of oil. This one's called Love Lady. European American design. I don't know what that is. This one is cocoa. Yep. Cocoa. I remember that bottle. I used to wear cocoa. Don't know what this one is. You'll have to look it up. Oh, there's a name on the bottom of it, but this is also missing the cover, but it's a full bottle. Well, almost full bottle. It's a big bottle. How big this bottle is it's huge. And next is Tommy Girl. There's a Tommy Girl cologne. And this one is Shalimar. There's only that much left in it, but it's, somebody will buy it just for the bottle. 
And this one is Private Spa Collection Embrace Today. Today is the name of it. I don't know. But it's almost a full bottle. This one looks like it might be just like a knockoff one. Cool Ocean Woman. Cool Water. Yes, our impressions of cool water. That's what that one is. So that's a total of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen bottles of perfume. Some vintage, some vintage. These are definitely vintage. Some new. This is definitely new. This Givenchy. Some missing covers. And then this one here, which I'm not sure. This is Paris. All right. Secret agent at 14. And Mimi is out. At this point, we have it reached the reserve, so we're going to have to pass on the lot. Yeah, absolutely. Because it will be too expensive for me to ship. I miss Love's Baby Soft. I want to see the cocoa bottle again. Um, we don't have a registration for you, but the lot's been passed. Yeah, we don't have a... Uh, does anybody know who this EJR Drenolin is? No, I do not. But I've already passed it because we haven't met the reserve. So we're going to okay. have to bring it back. Okay. We'll bring it back. Okay, Mama G. <laughs> T, are you almost done? Because I'm ready to say goodnight unless you want to keep going. You're, you're muted. I'm sorry. No, that's good. I'm good. You're good? Can I bring you in to say goodnight? Sure, absolutely. Okay. All right. <laughs> All right. T's chowing down in the background. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, it's quarter 12 and you still want to do your release tonight. Yeah. And then we're going to be on tomorrow morning at 10 for coffee on T's channel. And we're going to be doing some one-offs. Um, I've got some great one-off stuff that I'm going to, I'm going to feature tomorrow morning. Um, no, Robin, I did not say that. I just said that I was done. I didn't say I was tired. <laughs> All right, you guys, Mama G, thank you so much for helping me. Thank you, everyone that bought something for, from us. And I hope I hope uh, to see you tomorrow morning over at T's channel for coffee. And uh, T, anything else? No, thank you guys. We appreciate it as always. Thank you so much for coming in. And um, thanks again.